We now know that the Dongfeng E Pi 007 will launch on March 14. Set to come as both an extended range and all electric liftback, the four models will range in price from 159,600 to 199,600 yuan, 22,200 to 27,750 US dollars. Fully loaded with options, the car comes in at 234,600 yuan, 32,600 US dollars. The price breakdown for the various versions is as follows. The 200 Pro Extended Range Edition is priced at 159,600 yuan, approximately 22,200 US dollars. The 530 Pro version comes in at 166,600 yuan, about 23,150 US dollars. The 620 Pro version carries a price tag of 179,600 yuan, roughly 24,950 US dollars. Finally, the 540 AWD Max Edition is available for 199,600 yuan, equivalent to around 27,750 US dollars. Style-wise it follows the sports coupe look first popularized in China for EVs by the Xpeng P7, although the Dongfeng E-Pi 007 is actually a five-door hatchback. The front face has a very simple design and uses a split headlight cluster design. From the side the sleek lines that help give the car a 0.209 cd drag coefficient are apparent. The top of the line version has an electric rear spoiler which will be an option on other versions. Size-wise the Dongfeng E-Pi 007 measures in at 4880mm slash 1895mm slash 1460mm L slash with H, with a wheelbase of 2915mm. The two standard colors are night shadow black and dawn white there are an additional five cost option colors. The AWD Max version comes with 19-inch performance wheels, red brake calipers and continental tires, all other versions of the Dongfeng E-Pi 007 get 18-inch low drag wheels. Buyers can opt for scissor doors on the 620 Pro and 540 AWD Max versions. A cost option they are equipped with dual ultrasonic radar active obstacle avoidance and anti-pinch functions. Inside the car has an 8.8-inch LCD instrument cluster and 15.6-inch central display screen. Behind the SOA Intelligent Cockpit with 38 service modules is a Qualcomm Snapdragon 8155 chip. There are a total of 123 interfaces and over 300 custom scenes. Equipment includes a 20-speaker audio system, 64-color ambient lighting, 50W wireless charging for mobile phones, gesture recognition, electric six-way adjustment of the main driver's seat plus memory slash welcome, electric four-way adjustment of the passenger seat, ventilation slash heating of the front seat, etc. Hello and welcome back to EV's Queen, thank you for subscribing us. We provide the most recent and updated news about electric mobility every day. We're thrilled to introduce three unique membership levels on our channel, Circuit Squires, Tesla Knights, and Volt Sovereigns. Each level offers its own set of exclusive perks and content, perfectly suited for your passion for electric vehicles. As a member, you'll play a vital role in supporting our mission to deliver 14 engaging video updates daily about the latest in the electric vehicle world. Your membership not only helps sustain our efforts, but also brings you closer to the heart of the EV community. All versions of the car get assisted driving functions which includes forward collision warning, AEB automatic emergency braking, traffic sign recognition, adaptive cruise control, lane keeping assistance, lane merging assist, blind spot monitoring, lane change warning, rear traffic crossing braking, panoramic image, transparent chassis, etc. Higher spec versions gain an OA high-speed navigation assistance driving software subscription service and LAPA over-the-horizon memory parking software subscription service. These utilize the 31 sensors on higher spec versions which consist of 8 high-definition cameras for surround view cameras, 12 ultrasonic radars, 5mm wave radars, 1 intelligent driving domain controller, and a high-precision positioning unit. Range extended versions of the Dongfeng E-Pi 007 use a 1.5-liter engine as a generator. The rear 160 kW electric motor has a peak torque of 310 Nm. 
This version comes with a 28.39 kWh lithium iron phosphate battery which is good for 200 km CLTC electric range with a total range of 1200 km, acceleration time is 7.2 seconds. With the all-electric versions, the 530 Pro used the same 160 kW motor as the EREV, but this time with a 56.83 kWh lithium iron phosphate battery. The 530 in the model's name is the CLTC range and the acceleration time is 6.8 seconds. Unsurprisingly, the 620 Pro gets a 620 km range out of a 70.26 kWh lithium iron phosphate battery. Thanks though to a more powerful 200 kW electric motor with 320 Nm of torque, acceleration time is reduced to 5.8 seconds. Finally the AWD 540 Max uses the same battery as the 620 Pro but doubles up on the 200 kW motors giving a 3.9 second acceleration time. Interestingly the car comes not only with V2V and V2L but also V2G discharging. EPI is a new NEV brand under Dongfeng Elis launched last year in April at the Shanghai Auto Show. The EPI 007 is the first car to go on sale in what is meant to be a premium brand but presumably positioned below Dongfeng's Voya range. Thanks for watching, have a great day.